Hello, good people. Hello, and welcome back to more. Let's play the Mages Guild for the Elder Scrolls for Oblivion. Aha. Now, where the hell are we, anyway? And who is this guy? Yes, this is the man we left last time, but you know what? This man is different. He is a master mage. A master of all he surveys. Name a spell. He can do it. And I assure you, he is a master of everything. But how did this mage get to be where he is today? How did he become the master of this kick-ass tower? Sitting high in the northeastern mountains of Cyrodiil. Well, I will show you. It all began right after he got his recommendations for the Arcane University. But even then, he was a master mage. Observe. Wait, wrong button. Okay, now observe. This is my master mage, which I created when I first got the game. I love this character. I have had him since I got the game, and he is a master mage. Level 45. Atronach Birth Sign. High Elf. Incredible intelligence and willpower. Not too shabby on the personality, either. Every magical college, he has mastered it. You have no idea how long that took me. Good God, it took me a while. And he's only an apprentice in the Mages Guild, what the hell? Well, I will show you how this man will become the next Archmage of the Mages Guild. So anyway, enough of the crappy narrative crap. So, I'm going to show you a bit around the Arcane University first. Ho ho! I love the Mages Guild, my favorite of all the four guilds. If this ever decides to load. Load, damn you, I say! Come on, load. Load. Please load. Basically, I used the altars in the Arcane University and actually in the tower to create a bunch of custom spells. So, this is the uh, Lustratorium, or the Alchemy Shop, if you prefer. Buy all your alchemical ingredients here. Hey, it's another apprentice, but I'm way cooler than him. What? Oh, hello, Slay the Rogue. Oh, by the way, when you watch this, know that I didn't answer to your message right now because I was in the middle of recording. No offense. Alright. Uh, where was I? Oh, yeah. Alchemy. Normally, it takes two or more ingredients. However, as a master alchemist, all I need is one ingredient. And observe. Two. High quality health potions, right there. And she's annoying as hell, I'm not gonna talk to her. So yeah, we're three and a half minutes in and we have accomplished absolutely nothing because of my crappy opening, but oh well. This is the Chironasium. This is where you enchant items, basically. Yes. Whoa! Whoa! Actually, she's the uh, Illusion Master trainer. Before the Ages of Man, this is a skill book which you can read. And it boosts one of your magical skills, but I'm already at a hundred and everything, so makes no difference to me. Please go ahead. Please go away. No, I don't talk to the battle mages. All right, uh, practice rooms. You can basically just peep. There's mages in there practicing spells, summoning stuff like that. It's the Imperial Watchtower. Mage quarters. It's where everybody sleeps. No, talk, don't don't talk to me. Okay. I don't want to talk to them. Alright, uh, this is the Mystic Archives. It's like the library, basically. And this is the Praxographical Center. This is where you make spells. Please, go ahead. Please, go away. God, and I don't have time for this right now. Let's get to the quest. The Let's get to the actual guild. Go away, you two. I don't want to talk to you. You may be teachers here, and I'm just a student, but I'm still smarter than all of you. And where's Raminus? Oh, he's probably sleeping. Why would he be sleeping? It's only four in the morning. It's only four o'clock in the morning. 
Mage quarters. He'll be in here. Yeah, Raminus is a master wizard, but he doesn't hang out in the in the main tower with all the other master wizards. Because he doesn't have an ego the size of Lake Tahoe. Oh, God. And I'm actually not recording this with Pinnacle Studio. I'm using Windows Movie Maker. Just trying something different. See if it's easier or not. Raminus, talk to me. We come to the real work at last. You have no doubt seen some of the worst the guild has to offer. As much as we try to hold mages to a higher standard, they are only human. I'm not. What I hope you will now see is that while the guild can be disjointed and misused, it can also achieve some wonderful things. Now you have an opportunity to engage in more meaningful tasks and continue with your advancement through the guild. You mean we actually get to do something productive now? Tasks! Before you can begin work for the guild, you'll need to do something for yourself. Every mage carries a staff. It is crafted and enchanted by the guild and is a symbol of status. You need such a staff. All right. So where do I make this mage's staff? The wood used for staves comes from a grove to the northeast of the Imperial City near Wellspring Cave. Several mages tend to the grove and should be able to assist you. Speak with either Zarasha or Elet when you arrive and choose wisely. Choose wisely, young magister. You shall have a true mage's staff soon. Which I will never use because I can do everything that the mage's staff does. I've got my array of kick ass spells here heal legendary wounds, legendary soul trap, flame tempest. That's like a custom chameleon spell I made, gives me 100% chameleon. Daylight! Best light spell in the game. And, uh... I have a whole bunch of restore magic potions which I made using my advanced alchemy skill. Just because, um... I'm never too busy for good talk. Well, I am, so shut up. And actually, I'm gonna take this opportunity to, um... Set all the spells that I want. Yes, I have purchased every spell in the game. I know it's completely pointless, but you know what? It's only used to satisfy my immense ego, so... I think I, I have all the spells I want, don't I? No, I don't! There's my armor spell. My armor spell, which I will never use, but you know what I wanted on me? Actually, you know what? I want a summon spell. Lich jump! Yes! That's a nice spell right there. And I have fortified speed so I can go really fast. Hyper speed. Let's go to the cave and the actually the cove. The, well, shut up. Wellspring cave. Yeah. Fly, mage. Fly, fly, fly. We look totally ridiculous, but you know what? I don't care. And also, when we fight in the mages guild, it's gonna be a lot of magical battles, mages against mages, stuff like that. So I'm gonna take my time with these fights. I'm gonna draw them out. I'm gonna have fun fighting these necromancers. So Wellspring Cave is actually... We can take a little shortcut. All we need to do is go around here. <gasps> oh crap! Ow. Ow! Jump! <laughs> oh, fail! Heal! Magical healing. And you know what? Why am I swimming? I shouldn't be swimming. Aha! Walk upon water. I have the power to walk upon water. No Jesus jokes. Don't even go there. I don't care, but some people might, so. Ha. And I've completely gone in the wrong direction, haven't I? Way off course. <laughs> you can tell I'm going to be having a lot of fun being a mage. <laughs> and you can go back in the water whenever you want. <laughs> oh, I love being a mage. So, where's the cave? 
should be right over here. And it's gonna be really dark in this cave, so... Daylight! The most powerful light spell in the game. It's the middle of the night right now, and look how powerful it is. Everything's brighter. <laughs> Ooh, dark, ominous feeling. That wasn't my active quest? Oh, well. Oh my god, a necromancer! Summon a lich! Whoa, that's loud. Holy shit, that's loud. Magical duel! Miss! Wow, I missed again. Summon another lich! Come on, kill him! Kill her! See the power of a true mage. Or just die. I said die! Burn! Oh crap! Oh come on, just burn. Thank you! God, that took long enough. Excellent work, my lich. What you got? Necromancers always have really nice stuff on them. Oh no, it's Zarasha! She was supposed to help me with my staff. Oh well. Sorry, I didn't realize the combat was going to be so loud. Die! Third person battle! Way cooler! You can't see me! Ha 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 ha! Now you see me now, you don't. <laughs> he, he, he was here! He was here! Where was he? He was just here! Where are you, little car? He was here. He's swimming. <laughs> I hope you drown. I hope you drown. Actually, nobody's gonna come out that side, and I'm gonna meet him. It's gone. No, it's not. <laughs> oh God! Hey, you look just like Manamarco. That's Manamarco. Look! Look at him. That's Manamar. That's Manamarco. Major spoiler for the guild. You can tell I'm having a little too much fun because I'm being kind of sloppy right now, but you know what? I don't care. Oh my god! Run if you can, little girl. Come on, kill! Attack! Come on, Lich! Ow! Get out of my way! Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> now you see the power of a master mage such as myself. And now for this next part, I'll show you a different uh, summon spell. Dramora Lord. <laughs> what? Oh god, I forgot to get the key. The key to the freaking cave. Hyperspeed. Let's jump the ravine. We made it. Fly. It's a shame there's no flying spell in this game. Remember Morrowind, you could just levitate everywhere? You moved really slow, but still, it was really cool because you just fly over everything. But I suppose I couldn't have a fly spell in this game because of the city walls. The cities have their own isolated areas, and if you go up too high, then it would crash. So. Thank you. Now the door is open with the key. And this actually takes us out to that little island in the middle of the thingamabob. Whoa. What have we here? Another plaything? You will dance for me, little one. Yes, you will. I will make your corpse dance, and then tear itself apart. Oh, how nice. Feel my... Lich. Ah! Don't touch me with that thing! Stop touching me with that dagger. You are dead. Wait, what happened to my Dramora 